So this is um, ice carving. The class right now is actually contemporary restaurant cuisine, um, but it bumps right into garmanger. Garmanger actually is um, probably the course that this fits into better, but it, it starts in, in the spring, so warm weather and ice don't mix. Blocks are 300 pounds each, um, you know, so they're all prepared in uh, you know special ice houses that create these blocks for just for carving. And so they're you know they're they're 10 inches wide. We have everything from ice tongs to move them to clamp on and move them. We have chisels, we specialty ice carving chisel chisels and there's straight chisels, there's angled chisels, there's round curved chisels. Um, then there's a thing called a chipper, which is just a five or six pronged fork. It's like giving a haircut. Right here we're doing the Falcon Head logo. Black one, you can see the outline of it so far. We got a few other shapes going on as well. We got like an LC for Lackawanna College on the same block. We have L's and C's on different blocks. We got a, uh, a knife with two, or a plate with two knives crossed it. And we have uh, a spoon down on the end there. So we tried to keep them all kind of culinary or Lackawanna centric. <laughs> hey, easy there, Cochise. I didn't know water was flammable. Yeah, right? <laughs> it has been a trend in the restaurant industry to to, to have ice carvings at buffets and you know things. For, I mean, that's been I mean it's been a classical part of of, of, of the culinary industry for a long time. But um, you know, it has a contemporary flair to it. I don't expect them to be masters at this by the end of the day. But it, it, it's fun, and as you can see by the look on their faces, they're having a good time.